Oh my gosh, can it be? I finally am making another video. Holy camoly. I'm trying to compile these things so that the kids can down the road look back and see what all we did and why we did it. So, um, also sharing with my family and friends what we're doing here in Guatemala. And if you have taken on a second family, if you're starting all over like we did, showing you that it can be done and it can be done with fun, right? So on this video, you're gonna see lots of things. Um, we um, are gonna take a quick tour of this up here. We're gonna look down below at the walls that they're building up um, to maintain the structure and the integrity of the land and the house that we have here. We're gonna talk about this property behind us what could be happening there and we're going to take a look at a lot of pictures and videos of the kids over the last month or two and uh, yeah, it's going to be fun so hang in there let's get started okay let's take a little walk i'm going down the hill that's our house up there right there and that's part of the driveway up there backyard hi mia there's mia here comes Hefe. Looks <laughs> like a rat. Gianna. Okay, there's the lake out there. And they're reinforcing our wall. Our property does not go to here. Our property ends right there. So that's it. That's our property line. But our wall underneath this fence needs to be reinforced and needs to be built all the way across to hold the land. Um, because rainy season, man, everything just kind of avalanches, falls down. So um, this you can't really tell, but it's a straight drop down. It's, there's, look at way down there, houses and fields. Anyway, they're building over there, the wall. They just built this wall here and they've built two. There's one beside it. See this, this part right here is new and this is new. And see, it doesn't look that big, but look at where they are. These walls are tall, so they're now building and they had to make a landing for them to walk on because it was so sloped, can't even walk on it. And they're trying to carry concrete and rocks and everything. So, um, here they come again. Okay, let's go up the hill and I'll show you what's going on up there. Okay, take Hefe in the house, please. Thank you. Hi, Mia construction zone so this is part this is where they mix concrete a lot as is this right here let's see right there it's where they mix their concrete and stuff and now they're mixing down there i hear it so they've got to carry all these hand carry all these supplies um this right here they built this wall here for us to retain that ground so we don't lose our avocado tree um, and we're planning on building a little room around that avocado tree that will kind of go up to the second floor and down, and that will house our washer dryer, our laundry room. Um, that'll be our laundry room area. So kind of excited about that. Let's go up here. Everything's so green and pretty right now. Look at that. And the lake is beautiful. Usually right now it's raining every day. So we're getting close to being done with rainy season. Let me go up here. Whew. The humidity is high. We're at, I don't know, 65 to 7,000, 6,500 to 7,000 feet. And I get short of breath. Okay, so this right here is land that Sergio just bought. So um, I don't know if you can see. Up here is a white structure. It's a little efficiency um, apartment slash house and then there's another one on down that you are not going to be able to see this is going to be the door that we use to go in and out and then up here let me find it way up there that last little dark spot is another door a blue door so the property is that long but it's kind of straight up in the air and it's really cool it's a beautiful garden it's it's just gorgeous up there and the view is phenomenal so that's our new area with two casitas um to enjoy so if we have company come stay we'll get to um we'll get to let them choose if they want to stay in the house with us or stay at the casita so this is our new tile 
um, gas tanks because we don't have piped in gas here. There's another pila waiting to be installed, big trash can. But under here is our new tile for our main level that we're trying to keep dry from the rain. Okay, here comes my shadow. Anyway, here's another view of that property up there. Isn't that beautiful? Look at that. There's the blue door. Oh, they're coming out. That's one of the guardians. He's coming out. That's Adalberto. He's been working hard today. He's been staying up there. So there's the other house up there. You can kind of see a little bit of it. Okay, so here's our structure out here. Still under construction. I have the screens pulled. It's been pretty windy. Um, just to keep the weather out. And then, and then this is our bar. They haven't finished the top yet. They need to varnish things, protect it. But isn't this beautiful? Turned out really good. This is our living room slash dining room area up here. That's my new stove sitting in the floor. This is the fireplace. We had a fire um, and it's a double-sided fireplace. So we tried it out, but with all of the open areas, it makes the smoke want to suck out and into the space. So we are going to rethink um, the flow of the smoke on that. And then there's the pizza oven and they're going to shelf here and put wood down below here and a shelf on top here. So I have plenty of space for pots and pans and they put these neat dividers in. Look at this. Then nobody can get through. Um, they were just here, the carpenters today and said they're bringing the doors. So there will be double doors here and a single door here that we can lock. Um, they'll, they'll be coming. There will be cabinets on this wall. Um, lower cabinets and upper cabinets here. And then there is my oven ready to go. There is my sink ready to go. And another light fixture ready to hang up over the, the table in the, in the dining area of the family room over there. And there's my microwave oven. So then here's our view from up here. So that's looking down where we were just a minute ago. And then out to the lake. Isn't it beautiful? Look at that. And that screen is pulled, so it kind of blurs things, sorry. And they haven't finished these countertops yet. They still need to varnish them. This is where the cooktop will go. This is where the sink will go. And there's the pizza oven. There's all their tools. Um, yeah. And they still have to finish the floor, but it's really looking nice. I'm just really proud of it. And then this goes down the curly stairs, circular stairs, back to the side of the house and the front door. So that's where we are with all of our fun projects. So we've got a lot going on here at this house. Never a dull moment, Another I tell you. Another at the house, and here's Giovanni with his teacher. She has a motorcycle or a moped. He thinks it's a motorcycle, and he is pretty impressed with this teacher. And she's so nice. Look at her. She lets him sit up there and even start it. She even took him for a little spin. And here, how many people can you fit in the back of a pickup truck? Or can you pump your kid down the street like that? Here's my crew getting ready to go to church. We love our Sunday pictures. We always look our best. Oh, look at them. Aren't they so cute? Look at that. They pick out their own outfits. I think they do pretty good. Almost to church. Careful, kids. Careful. Walking down the sidewalk. Let's see. Are we there? We got to be careful so we don't get run over by a car here. Here we go. There's the church. There it is. We made it. Okay, watch out, Giovanni. Go up the ramp. The ramp is easier. There you go. Oh, I got the step. Yeah, you did the step. Okay, come on. Let's go. Oh, my goodness, you guys. Learning to wash dishes. And here Ms. we Betty are Miss Betty Parker here, making my cinnamon rolls. Yeah, you make it. Mm -hmm. Sourdough cinnamon rolls, so. This is? This has, uh, no. This has been um, setting for, since last night, and now it's like two in the afternoon. Ooh, there you go, you can eat it up. 
And uh, anyway, I'm going to roll this out and make some cinnamon rolls. Doesn't that sound like fun? They're pretty good, actually. They're sourdough. It really doesn't take long. I used to think that this was like, oh my gosh, you have to be a magician to make baked goods, right? But um, it's not that hard. So this is just the dough, and then I'll make up the cinnamon filling part, put it on, roll it up, call her done. I think it's pretty good. And um, what I do with it, because I don't eat a lot of this. I mean, I eat a little bit of it, but... Um, I feed the men upstairs that are working on the house because, you know, it doesn't cost a lot. It's flour and it's my sourdough mix, right? Um, and I can make this and it feeds all of them up there for, you know, their snack for the day. Or like yesterday, I'll show you this one. Excuse me. This is my um, carrot cake that I made yesterday. I took a bite because I wanted to see if it was good. It's so good. It's so moist, but I add sourdough to it. It's so good. So, yeah. So, yeah. So, yeah. That's what I'm doing. Sunday afternoon, making cinnamon rolls, and it's going to make me some hot tea and relax just a little bit. So, let's see how these turn out, shall we? You rolling out your dough? Yeah. She's working hard. I always have helpers. And these I saw you. have to rise again, so we're waiting. And she's playing. You got it? Yeah. I really like it. Okay, what do you want to put on it? And then you can roll it up and put it in the pan. You want Nutella? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me get it. Yes, your bunny. Okay, spread it on A hundred. A hundred. Oh, there you go. Oh, that's looking delicious. And then you gotta roll it up. Like this? No, like we did a minute ago. Is it good? Yeah. All these kids just love to buy tortillas, and these are their favorite tortilla ladies. And here's a glimpse of Giovanni watching his tablet. Look at him go. He's always stimming in one way or another, and he absolutely loves his iPad or tablet time every day. Well, the kids have fun eating pizza, and I, well, I keep working on my figure. No pizza for me. I'm not gonna lie, I love the way the girls are choosing to dress. I just think it looks so dainty. There's bread man, that's full of bread. Look at him go. Bread man, bread. The new football field down below. 
and homework mm -hmm. time. Gianna just loves it. <laughs> Amelia gets frustrated. And what happened? I have curly hair now. It's hormones. Oh my goodness. There we are eating again and another fun Sunday morning picture. I love the material in this skirt. Isn't that pretty? And look at her. This is what I call talent and hard work and barefoot walking down the street in her skirt, carrying her load. There's our church. We made it. Isn't it beautiful and old? Wow. I just love it here. After church, we made it through mass. And now it's time to play. They're going to give me a fashion show. They're doing a fashion show for me. Okay. Amalia and her baby. Okay. Okay, show me your fashion show walk that you do. There you go, Gianna. Woo -hoo -hoo! Oh my goodness. Oh, fancy. Yes. Okay. Woo -hoo -hoo! Clap, Mom. <laughs> Oh, Malia. There she is, Maria. She calls her Malia, but she's trying to... That was a firecracker. Maria. A Malisa. Okay. Here we go. That's a church over there. Good job. Woo, woo, woo. And Giovanni's coming up next. There we go. Yay! Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. Beautiful! Yay! Bows and curtsies. Okay, let Giovanni have his turn. There's Giovanni's modeling. No, no. Woo! Don't fall off. Good job, Giovanni! Excellent, excellent. Good job. Oh, my girls, they just love to pose. And I love taking their pictures. A paper bird I had to make for Giovanni. And more posing. You guessed it. Oh, oh. And another poser. Wait for it. Giovanni sure has fun at school. Look how happy he is. And here's Daddy walking the kids into school. Another morning at school. I like to work. You want to work up here? Don't, don't bang on the floor. Yeah, I want to work. Not right now. Freeze them! My holidays get back. In. That's their tools. That's their stuff. We're not working up here right now. They're taking a break. Where are you going? <coughs> Leave them alone. They're having a break. Don't bother them. He wants to work. He's asking me how many minutes. Everything's minutes. minutes. Giovanni and I FaceTimed. See us in the corner? Gianna's doing a presentation with her teacher in class, and there's Amalia doing another presentation with her teacher in class. And there we are FaceTiming and watching while Dad stands faithfully by. Giovanni with some of his schoolmates at the lake in Panahachel. We wore them out. I got you, I got you, go, 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 go. Okay. Well, go. My battery's almost dead.
What happened? Yay! And here we're going on a picnic with dad and a couple of our neighbors. Look at this cute little park. I love these swings. Look at that. A lot of fun. Swinging, sliding, having a picnic, and taking lots of pictures. We had so much fun. And yes, Amelia got tense. Look at this picture. She just gets frustrated at the simplest things. The poor little thing, she cannot control those emotions. And there's the little cutie pie striking another pose and another pose. I tell ya, they're so cute and they just love posing. And they're gonna love looking back at these pictures. Giovanni, are you cool? There was a river running right alongside here, or maybe a creek, but it was full and flowing. There I am swinging, and there's my husband who walked through a spider web. Looks like he's spider picking web. cooties, doesn't he? He walked right into a spider web. I just spider hate web. that feeling. And there's Giovanni in the ball pit. It was actually at the same park, outdoors, a big net full of balls. Look at that. What fun. Oh, a beauty treatment for piojos, otherwise known as head lice. Ick. Pretty girls, though, and pretty flowers from the market. And a phone call with my husband on FaceTime. There he is. Handsome hubby and a beautiful view. As we end rainy season, another storm is coming in. It's 4.30 in the afternoon. Oh, giddy up. I can't wait for the lightning, the thunder, and the rain. Just beautiful. Well, friends, that's it for this video. Look at that. Clowns, clowns, everywhere's clowns. I see one more down there. I see you, I see you. Silly kids. Be careful, Giovanni. Anyway, I hope that you enjoyed watching the video, the pictures, the, the little snippets here and there, and the narrative. You know, I try to let you know what, what each, each little picture is showing you. Um, oh, my goodness. It's, it looks horrible up here because of the construction, but, I mean, it's actually, if you look this way, it looks really beautiful. <laughs> Just depends on the angle, right? Isn't that the way life is? It depends on the angle, the beauty, and the eye of the beholder, right? Isn't that what they say? Anyway, um, we're just so excited to share our pictures and videos and hoping that the kids will get to enjoy them along the way as they get older. And also hoping that um, my husband and family back in Texas and in Iowa and all over get to watch these videos and see the kids growing. Um, we miss, oh, go see what Hefe's barking at. Hurry. We miss, we miss everybody tremendously back, back in the States. And, um, we're hoping for visitors before long. So, um, are you going to be one of those visitors? I don't know. There goes Giovanni. There goes Giovanni. Go see what Hefe's barking at. Be careful, okay? A broken leg wouldn't be too good, would it? I tell you. There's always something going on. Anyway, I guess that's it for this video. Um, I've got a lot more pictures and videos that I need to put together. I've just been kind of lazy and doing other things. Really following a diet plan and um, studying on that. Hola. Hola. There's one of the guardians. Yeah, there he goes. And um, just studying on that. Um, if you haven't, if you're my age or around there, perimenopause, menopause, postmenopause, <gasps> menopause, Anna Kabeca. I highly suggest you read it. She has the keto green diet and it is awesome. So you not only are doing kind of the keto diet, but you're adding in a lot of greens and watching hormone levels and all of that. And it's fabulous. Oh my goodness, these kids. I gotta go. I got things going on out of control. You guys say a prayer for me. I'll say a prayer for you. And I'll see you on the next video. Goodbye, everybody.
Remember, put on your princess dress, adjust your crown, wear your high heels, dance, giggle, and have a good time. Enjoy life, friends.